Hello, everybody. I'm Dr. Mike. And that's... Ari. How old are you, Ari? I'm 11. I'm 29, so we're basically the same age. I also want to introduce my special friend who you may not have seen as back. Look at this guy. Speak. Good boy. He just slobbered all over my face. Today, we're going to be doing disgusting science. I want to know why feet Making stink. Making fake snot. And? That's in Spanish. That is in Spanish. Can you translate the sentence? I have a dog named Bear in Russian. Yeah, you kakashka. He said he wants poop. It's the grossest, most revolting science kit out there. Grow your own friendly germs and fuzzy molds. Mix up a batch of coagulating fake blood. It says learn science in a disgusting new way. No, right. no. Okay. If you've watched my channel, you're gonna know the answer to this question. Where do I tell everyone that watches my channel to never put these? In your butt. <laughs> in your butt. Where do most people put these? <laughs> I feel like we shouldn't have a dog here. It's like a biohazard. You need a slice of bread. You need vinegar. I don't think I have any bread. Do you, you have bread? bread? No. Why? Do you eat bread? I don't like eat it. Yeah, I use it for sandwiches. So you do eat it? Yeah. All right, you want to do the s sickening, slimy snot? Sickening, slimy snot that looks so real. You might just want to barf. First, we have to do is measure one tablespoon of water into the bowl and microwave it for 15 seconds. Okay, this is a teaspoon. So how many tablespoons are in a teaspoon? Strike that. Reverse it. Okay, so that's one teaspoon. That's two teaspoons. Three teaspoons. 15 seconds in the microwave, let's go. On the bottom of the microwave, on the touchpad. Bear! Do you see why you don't let dogs around science experiments? Okay, um, remove from the microwave. Well, I think we did that. Yes. Add one drop of green coloring to the water and stir to... Dilute. Dilute, I knew that. The suspense is killing me. I think it goes by itself. No? Okay, you're not patient. Okay. By the way, this is a good, great way to stir. If you just want to stir something, you can just do this. Yeah, like wine. Why do you know that? <laughs> one tablespoon? Yeah, so then three You're sure this. one tablespoon? That sounds like way too much. Try that and let's see what happens. Maybe that is a tablespoon, not a teaspoon, and we messed up. More like you messed up. We're a team. I feel like we're making such a mess. We're the worst scientists ever. All right, you have to do better when you're in med school. <laughs> Why would I be in med school? Why, you don't want to go? And... Three. Okay. Oh, it <laughs> smells. Smell it. Oh! Maybe it's just like your water. What? It might have really bad water. Let's just keep going before like, I throw up. What's the learning objective from this? It says digestive science secrets. Your nose is lined with mucous membrane that makes mucus. Okay. Mucus is the scientific term for snot. Its sickness helps trap dust and dirt particles in the air you breathe. Without mucus, your lungs would eventually get clogged with dust and lots of dirty gunk. Okay, so can I put some of this on your face? No. Just a little bit. Okay, first let's like scoop it out. Ew. If you put it right next to my nose, I'm gonna have No, you're not. No, 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 no. Just no, no, a little no. bit. How will we put it on Bear? He, uh, he's no, used to it. Uh, uh, get a napkin, I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> oh, it's so slimy. Oh, and it smells. <laughs> No, get that thing off me. Do I have any? I don't know. Look at my face. No. Oh, why do we need bread for everything? Should I just knock on all my neighbor's doors? Hey, do you have bread? Yeah, yeah, are you home? Yeah. Do you have a piece of bread? No. Nothing? No, any kind? I need it for a science experiment. I don't have a number of bread, bro. Yo, we got to get that bread, son. I got cash, though. So that's bread. You got cash bread. We just got some bread. Let's do disgusting digestion. Okay, we need the balloon. Balloon, check. <laughs> Down. Why are you touching my balloon? <laughs> we need vinegar. We need vinegar? Tell me a fun fact about you while we wait for our plate. I can tell you what I want to be, girl. What do you want to be when you grow teacher. up? Teacher. What kind of teacher? I'm not sure. That's what I'm trying to figure out what's my favorite subject. But why do you like teaching? Because mm, you got to make an impact on people. You can make an impact in doing many jobs. Why that one? Because the boy meets world and Mr. Feeney. I wonder if you guys even know what that is. Or Malcolm in the Middle, Saved by the Bell. This kid is stuck in the 90s. How many breads do we need? Breads? It says a slice of bread. So one. What else? Pour some cooking oil. Where? In the thing. In here? Yeah. That's hard. And he's somehow a doctor. You have to rub it inside. <laughs> Take some bread from the center of the slice and break it up into small pieces. Why are you putting it here? No, because it's a seed. You're a seed. <laughs> the small things always count. Stuff. The, the small pieces into the stomach. So stuff the small pieces into this. The balloon. 
How much pieces do we need? I don't know, just throw a bunch of them here, put some in here. Add a few drops of vinegar into the balloon. My favorite number is 19 for amendment 19. Okay. It said a few drops, you know. Okay, we put Whatever. a lot of bread in. All right, so so far this is pretty accurate. You have your stomach, you eat the food, the food goes into the stomach, the okay. acid is the vinegar, it all mixes in because the stomach mixes it up. Here, you squeeze it up. Tell me more to me. <laughs> this kid is still singing Grease songs. I'm gonna put you on some good music. Who's your favorite musician? Who am I supposed to know? Continue squeezing hand and over hand over hand. As you do this, the stuff inside will ooze out the opening and put it on into the plate. Now oh, that's nasty. I get it. Oh! Look at that. The intestine has muscle in it. And the muscle rhythmically contracts like this, as your fingers are. And as it contracts, it pushes the food forward and forward and forward. Which is now comes into poop. <laughs> and then it ends up being poop. And you see how it's on my fingers now? You wanna eat it? Like no, I'm gonna ah! eat it. <laughs> the stomach has acid in it, it has food in it, it mixes it up, and then when it goes into the intestine, the muscles through peristalsis push the food along and, and then it comes out. And some parts of your stomach are still a little bit tasty. Do you wanna see another experiment? I wanna see another experiment. Do you wanna see another experiment? Blood and guts. What do we need? Gelatin. Check. Red coloring packet. Red coloring packet. What? Is that a packet? Yeah. Step one. Water. Half a cup? Yes. Add one half of a cup of water into a microwave safe bowl. Heat the water to boiling in a microwave oven. Add one half tablespoon of gelatin. Okay, throw this in the microwave. I need. God. Look, how is that my fault? Perfect. What does it smell like? Put the food coloring oh. in. One, two, three. Oh. Mm. We're totally not even following the instructions at this point. <laughs> this actually looks kind of good, doesn't it? Like, it kind of looks like jam. Let's do something fun out of this, because this is actually yeah, turning out pretty Let's just, awful. like, take this off. No, let's do this and try and decorate our faces like we're, we're, like, injured. Make me look like a boxer who just got beat up. I'm gonna do what I want to do. No, no lipstick. Cross. You are my daughter. <laughs> we will now look upon ourselves. Okay, okay, and okay. See the truth. Enough on my face. <laughs> you're my hair! No, it's not in your hair. <coughs> I told my... You... Oh, I like this. Hold on, I'm... <laughs> Giving you whiskers. <laughs> oh! He's dying. This turned out to be a huge failure, but I hope you guys had fun with us. Yeah, I wanted to do some red. Did you have fun? <coughs> you look like you had fun. Did you have fun? Tell him if you had fun. As always, <laughs> say it, say it. Stay say happy and, and healthy. You got on my sweater. <laughs>